Do you know I got up at 6 o'clock this morning for this? You get up at 6 every day! Hey, that's not the point! Hello again to Hopkinton High School for HHS Today. I'm your host, Kale McGeckert, and today we're excited to bring you a pilot we recently recorded for our new HHS TV series. But first, we have a club to introduce you to. But before all of that, let's dive in right into our question of the day. This week we asked, what is your favorite fictional character? What's your favorite fictional character? Our favorite fictional character is Dwight K. Schrute. <laughs> Matt, what's your favorite fictional character? Stress. Uh, Harry Potter. Lenny Sachs. <laughs> Ross Geller from Friends. Um, my favorite fictional character is Barney Stinson from How I Met Your Mother. Now I'm going to have to go with uh, Rick from The Walking Dead because he is a savage and he's got a really awesome beard. My favorite fictional character is Batman because he drops bodies like no other. Uh, mine would be Captain America because I love America like no other. Um, I'd have to say Tyrion Lannister from Game of Thrones. Walter White from Breaking Bad because... He's a menacing dude, and he has a lot of evil genius plans. Eric Cartman from South Park. Squidward Tentacles from SpongeBob SquarePants. Um, I'd say Bill Gates. Um, my favorite fictional character is uh, Aphrodite because he came from humble beginnings. My personal favorite character is Frozen from The Incredibles. Next up, we recently spoke to Make-A-Wish Club to find out more about their activities. Hi, I'm Robin. I'm president of Make-A-Wish Club. These are some of our members and um, our treasurer, Haley. Uh, the goal of Make-A-Wish Club is to raise money for kids with terminal cancer to grant one wish for them. The Make-A-Wish Club at Hawkins High School has been around for several years. We meet Thursdays after school at 2 in Miss Martin's room, which is room 309. The main thing that we do here is we fundraise, and some of the fundraisers we've done is we've sold carnations at Valentine's Day and candy canes for winter vacation. <laughs> After collecting the money, we send it to the foundation, and this year we're hoping to grant a child their wish. I joined this club because I want to make a difference in a child's life. I think it was a worthy cause. Making a difference in a child's life is the, a worthy cause. We do some really fun fundraisers, and Make-A-Wish is a great cause. My friends have been personally affected by Make-A-Wish. So we're a pretty big club, but all you have to do is show up at one of our meetings to get involved. For more information, you can email me at roslander at hillers.org. And by the way, they are running a fundraiser, and here they are to tell you all about it. Our next fundraiser is going to be April 24th to 28th at lunches. It's going to be a raffle basket. I hope to see you all there. There you have it. You can really make a difference in someone's life and hope their raffle is a huge success. And while we're on the topic of making a difference, Relay for Life invites you to the Students vs. Teachers basketball game on Thursday, April 13th, 6 to 7.30 p.m. in the HHS Athletic Center. Yeah, that's tonight. Admissions is $5, but if you signed up for Relay for Life, your price is only $3. There will be concessions, a 50-50 raffle, and lots of fun watching your favorite teachers and students compete. What could be a better way to kick off your April vacation? And now we are ready to present to you the pilot episode of a new HHS TV series, and it's a game show. Hello, Hawking and High School. I'm your... No, that's the HHS TV opening. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome to Class Royale, HHS Today's Game Show. I'm your host, Chris Pomeroy, and today we have with us Ben Nigrosh and Ian Holmes. Hello. Hello. A coin flip has determined that Ben will go first, and we start with our rapid fire round. Ben, would you please choose a category? I'm going to do HHS. The HHS Athletic Center has an indoor track. What adjacent town also boasts one? Oh. Ben, you have the floor. Holliston? Holliston is correct. 100 points for Ben. Ian, mm -hmm. you may now choose a category. I am feeling science. Science. What is the only letter that does not appear on the periodic table? Looks like Ben comes in again. Uh, J. J is correct. Ben, play goes back to you. Choose a category. I'm going to go with art. From today, painting is dead. Which painter made this statement upon seeing a photograph for the first time in the mid-1800s? Ian? Hmm. Um, vanilla ice. 
I'm sorry, <laughs> Vanilla Ice is incorrect. Ben, you have a chance to answer. Um, I, I will know, yeah. go C. Paula Delaroche is the correct answer. Ben, 100 points. This brings us to the end of our rapid fire round. Let's see what the standings are. Um, I'm getting 800 for Ben and 400 for Ian. We now move into our double or nothing round. Here, contestants can wager any number of points they have. The category for our double or nothing round is entertainment. Contestants, write down how many points you would like to wager. Remember, Ben, you have 800, Ian, 400. Excellent. What is the highest grossing movie of all time adjusted for inflation? Jaws, Titanic, Star Wars, or Gone with the Wind? Write down your answer on the scorecard in front of you. Contestants, please show your answers. They have both answered C, Star Wars. The correct answer is Gone with the Wind, D. Ah. Unfortunately, you have both lost your points. <laughs> but we now get the standings, and it seems Ben has won. Congratulations, Ben. You've done a great job. Thank Ian, you very much. Thank you so much for coming on today. Oh, my pleasure. We hope you liked it, and we'll be bringing you more information as we polish and expand this production. And hey, would you like to be a contestant? Drop us an email and let us know. If you're unsure of how much fun we have here, visit our website to see the outtakes. And now it's time for Have You Seen This? And I'm happy to announce that we have winners. Congratulations to all of you and stop by Mrs. Muhar's desk in the main office to collect your prize. Due to the vacation next week, we'll be with another picture on our next episode. And that's what we have for you today. Visit us at hcam.tv slash hhstv for more about our show and exclusive online-only content. Like behind the scenes and bloopers from our new show, Class Royale. So check it out. We'll be back in a couple of weeks with another episode. Meanwhile, if you have some stuff we should know about, suggestions for what we should be doing, complaints, or just to tell us how much you like us, we're at hhstv at hillers.org. That's it for now, and we'll see you next time. And so, hmm. <laughs> would you like one? I would love one.